You're awesome. <laughs> Don't do anybody. Don't, what's the scoop deal? Are, are they, are they gonna, they're going to be here for a while. They're going to share the space with the, well, one more with the marathon people. Huh. Put some fences on. No coming and going on Sunday, but they're going to try to work things out, I guess. Yeah. Nice to see you guys all here. Hey, hey. Occupations are a crime unless yeah, I mean, it's done by civilians. <laughs> You're getting older. <laughs> we all are. Joe? Uh, uh, you know, uh, I the I saw a four trucks of Robocop, so. It's still out, Rich. What's that? I want to get this. U.S. Congress, it's a joke. They were on. Did they get on again? U.S. Congress, it's a joke. Let me just show off for hey, hey. this guy who's doing what I imagine will be something, and I'm going to explain to you that the that the empire that we have that is has a complicity, the clearest sign of this complicity is the fact that there were tens of thousands of, of deaths in Central America not 15 years ago based on a, 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 a naked force repression supported by the United States. And who in the world, who in our political world is protesting this? A uh, uh, massacre of innocent, liberty-loving Central Americans. Why? Nobody. And and that is the that is the clearest sign that it is all of us who are really uh, to blame for the sad uh, condition of tyranny under which we labor today. Because so few of us are saying we morally have been implicated in massacres of thousands of people, of the archbishop of the country being machine gunned at high mass in the municipal city of San Salvador by the presidential candidate supported by the United States. And that, that crime against humanity has been supported by the United States because the arranger of the massacre went to the United States and asked for and received political asylum. Now, how in the world can this quiet but consistent support of tyranny around the world be ever changed with the United States population never objecting to it? One way of change might be educating people, and that's kind of what you're doing right I now. And I appreciate that. Yeah. Thank you. Joe. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Thank okay. you for being out here, guys. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Now, where the hell is our... our the guy that wrote it first sung it, he died about what, three months ago or so. Really? Yeah, the age of 76. Yeah. I'd say it's close to about 6 o'clock right now.